beautiful. Oh, beautiful. Oh. So, well, welcome, welcome because we did a big challenge this week and it was crazy. We did, it was fun. <laughs> She's Look. like, it was crazy. And I'm like, it was fun. I know. Jana kept it really, really fun. I was a little stressed. I get a little stressed. But it was fun. It really it was. It was so much yeah. fun. Yeah. So there you go. Yeah. So here we go. Are you ready for... Um, <laughs> She's like, am I ready? I don't I'm know. not ready. I got to Loy real. Uh, <laughs> so, yes. This is where we get to be real with you mm -hmm. guys. Like, real, real. Yeah. Like the real fact that I, we have no makeup on tonight because mm -hmm. the um, products that we purchased we're going to try on air oh, and give you a first impressions, which first will be fun. So I'm always yes. talking about skincare, right? You are. And I am reviewing and trying out a new product that was sent to us in a PR package, and mm -hmm. I'm in love with it. And I'm very sad. I can't tell you what it is yet, so I'm going to have to keep you waiting. But I really like. I love this product, and so I can't wait to share. And not it only with does, you. do you love it, but it's like been doing amazing things yeah like yeah just amazing just yeah. amazing so that will be coming up so mine is you not know. skincare mine's not even beauty related no but it's fun it is so anyone that knows me knows what my favorite season is i have a daughter with that for a middle name so yes. it tells you how obsessed i am with fall yeah my kids go back to school next week so i am full-blown fall mode i don't care that it's like 90 degrees out no no, she, she texted me. She's like, I'm pulling my fall stuff out. I'm like, what? Yep, house is all decorated. It it's smells like beautiful. pumpkin. It does. So I am like, it Starbucks, got, pumpkin spice latte. Come on. You're ready like, for it. I am and ready. It got me in the mood. I'm like feeling a little fall, so it's all good. Well, you spent all day at my house smelling the pumpkin and the spice. And I did. Winning you over. So with that fall, you <laughs> are, with that fall mode, we made a really we fun did. drink tonight. So cheers to all of you. This is a salted caramel martini. <gasps> Yum. Oh. It smells good. It tastes so good. That is really good. Really One good. would be enough. That's all I'm saying. Yes. One would be enough. And it's sticky. It's really sticky. So it's here sticky. we are. When you drink your salted caramel mm -hmm. martini, you'll have sticky fingers. You will. Oh my goodness. So that recipe will be on happy hour post on Friday. You're yes, going to want it because it is delicious. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yum. So, okay. Hey, Harry, thanks. I know I got my hair done today. I heard you got a hair a hair uh, appointment this week too. So you have you haven't I have to see. I have to see you. You have to post a little picture. So yeah. All so right. are you ready for this? Oh my goodness. I don't know. So what do you think? Do you think that we were able to go to the store yes. and get makeup for a total pre tax for twenty dollars? For date night. For date night. Do you think we really really did it? Full face. Yeah. So if you think we did it we want to see a thumbs up emoji. If you think we were not able to, we want to see a thumbs down mm -hmm. emoji. Yes. Yeah. So we will show you our receipts at the end because we saved them. We went to Walmart. We did. Because we went to Walmart. most everyone has one around them. And it's usually the, they have the best prices. Yes. So yes. yeah. All Are right. You? Are you ready? We're ready. Oh, I'm here so we go. Excited. I know, right? You know what? We have no mirrors. We have no mirrors. We have no mirrors. This is going to be really interesting. <laughs> this is going to be really fun. We're going to use the monitor. So we this do have a monitor, so that is good. So we would love it if you could like and share. Yes. Let people know, especially now since we have no mirrors. But you know what? We are in our beauty studio. And we so are. because we're in our beauty studio, that means that the things behind us have mirrors. One. Oh, I don't no. think that window. That window doesn't. No, so we will share. We're sharing, sharing is caring. We're sharing. Oh my gosh, it just gets better and better. It does. All right, so. What are you using for your foundation? I know, this is, everything is new to me. That's the other thing. We we really yes. not only wanted to do a challenge um, for the dollar amount, but for new products that we've yes. never tried. And so I'm using Remmel's Clean and Fresh Foundation. It has vitamin A and E in it. It's supposed to erase my pores. Awesome. Yeah, I am using? using Rimmel. This is their Match Perfection. It has sunscreen. It has so we both picked visibly Rimmel. perfected skin is what it's supposed to be. It's yeah. pore blurring. SPF of 20, and it says 24-hour moisturize. Yeah, and mine actually said poreless look. Awesome. 
So, so you know us with foundations. We are big on smell. We are yeah. big on smell, and I'm big on a beauty blender too. Uh, yes, I am using. Um, it's not beauty okay, blender, but it's so a this has sponge. a paddle in it. Oh my goodness, this is very thick. Yeah. yeah, this is like really thick. So it's like she's got super cool coverage over there, and I got you know. Like, Actually, it doesn't have any smell. Mine, does yours? A little bit, but it's not. It's yeah. Not bad. Way to go, but, Remmel, because so, I cannot stand chemically smelling maybe, things. Maybe like. You're, <laughs> I thick. need a paddle. <laughs> Just saying. Yours is thick too. Okay, well while you're fighting, oh dear. Like God. <laughs> oh 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 oh. It's okay. happening. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. It almost feels like put. It's really. Is it thick? <laughs> it looks thick. It, it looks like. It thick. is not the right color either. <laughs> Yay! Are we ready? All right. No, but really. No, oh, but so really. Funny. <laughs> okay, so this is really, 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 really thick. Okay, so other than Can it being feet? thick, no, I'm gonna just. I do this so much that I'm like, I know where my face is. I like that it has no smell. Yes, that is big. Mine has a slight smell, but it's nothing overly bad. So, mine I do not think is a good match for me, though. I'm looking a actually a little orange. Well, that's the true test. If I'm gonna ox do anything. Oh wow, a mirror! I'm like Sharon is here. We're so on it. I know, right? It's been you know Thursdays I think are harder than Wednesdays. Okay. I have no idea if this all blended, but did you like your enough. mirror back? Well, yeah, it's our mirror, but yeah. Um, actually, it doesn't look that bad. It doesn't look here. bad. Okay. Right. Well, well, that I wasn't need... that wasn't a fail, so that's good. I need more. I know, right? So, what do you guys think? Do you think we were able to do this for twenty dollars or not? We would love to know what you think. And do you think you could do it for twenty dollars? That's a good. That's question. what I want to know, right? All right. So what are you getting into next? So I'm getting into this is by CoverGirl. This is their Ready Set Gorgeous Cover Up, which we concealer. love. That foundation, we love it. Like, love it. Like, love, love, and love, love we, it. We were both like, well, we could get that because it's like six dollars, and mm -hmm. we know we like. It, but we're like, no. Yeah. No. For the sake of this, let's be new. It's just easy breezy, beautiful on the inside. So here we go. All right. So overall, we see. I don't think this is bad. And actually, I don't think the color is that bad on me. Actually, it's not. So it's actually not. I'm kind of impressed. I'm impressed a little bit. Okay. So it has some chemical smell to it. Does it? Yeah. No. So not too too bad. I am using Elf. Yes, that'll be interesting. It will be interesting. Everything will be interesting. So okay. we've not like, played with these. We've pre-opened the packages. You guys have packages. no idea. Like, there's no primer. We could not afford primer. We couldn't primer. afford the primer. And I'm just telling you, like, yeah. I'm just saying. I might need the mirror for this. <laughs> you think? Hold on. Let me let me dot my face in a couple strategic places. So we're going to be multi-purposing some of these products also because... If not all of them. We just need to. Because heavens for... I mean, yeah. Okay. I'm serious. Well, yours is light. Mine is very much skin toned. Meaning I am not going to get much of a highlight. And it's mine's really pink <gasps> undertones. So Carrie is on the fence. She's adding up the amount of products you guys um, have. And she's becoming more doubtful. It'll be interesting. It will be. I'm we'll like, show seriously. you our receipts at the end. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All I know is we stood oh, in the beauty aisle for a while. Forever. I'm like not wild. Right? It was. We have no other mirror. I, <laughs> I'm looking so hard. I'm like, where's another mirror? Okay. Ha. Hang on. I have a phone. Look, here. We're telling you. We will teach you the tricks. Because when you think. You can't. We'll figure out we a way will. you can. So. All right. So I don't like my concealer only because it's not light enough. When I use a concealer, I want it to highlight under my eyes also and give me that nice I've slept when I really haven't look. I cannot. Um, I can't decide. And I, it's not as, you know, what I use on the daily is Tarte Shape Tape. And that's a good thick so coverage. If you concealer. yeah, if you've ever used that, you know, like it covers 
all of the sins around my eyes, all of them. Mm -hmm. So um, this is not that. So I'm having, but you know, I have to tell you, it actually is not bad. Mm -hmm. I don't like it. Look, it's not bad. No, that's not bad. It's not bad. This is just, it. I think this is darker than my foundation, actually. I think it might be, actually. I think this is darker than my foundation. Actually, actually looking at you, you may not want to look. It is. It, it's, darker it's darker than darker. my foundation, and that it was darker. fair. Yeah. I could use it to contour. You could use it to contour. All right, so I am moving on to setting my face because I have oily skin, and that's a necessary. So I am using the Wet n Wild Make a Glow. This is a contour palette, and it has a contour side, and it has a powder side. I'm hoping this will work to set my face. So we're going to see. I'm really like, yeah. You know what I just realized as I'm contouring is the fact that I did not get a contour pow contour powder because again we only had twenty dollars. I was going to pick up some travel size baby powder to set my face with because you can do that in a pinch. Yeah. You have to be light handed because you'll turn into Casper or the ghost. You know, let's be real about that. But, but in a pinch. In it a will pinch, work. it really will work. So I was going to pick up a travel size. Um, but, but did she have enough money? Yeah. That's the question. I, that's what I was just going to say. So we're, you're still, Carrie's added things up. She's not so sure. I'm just saying. Okay. We're sharing. The nice, the nice thing about that is. Okay. All right. So here we go. So multi, multi-purpose, multi-task. I have no setting powder. So it'll be very interesting <laughs> to see how my blush plays. So I got this um, palette from Alme, um, and I got yes. it for a couple reasons. One, I was going to say, fallout is a significant thing with this, just saying. Yeah, uh, yeah. Don't wear black. Don't wear black, or leave your rope. Oh, 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 it has a, it has a little curved applicator. <laughs> it's falling out. And we yeah. haven't even drank our martinis. We've had so, a sip. So here's the deal. I picked this one for a couple reasons. One, I liked the colors. I thought mm -hmm. they were going to work well for me. Two, I also thought that they would work for multitasking really well. That I could do a blush here and possibly do a contour. We'll see. Um, mm -hmm. And then maybe even a highlight. highlight. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to use this on my eyes and my cheeks because, because let's get real about this. It was yeah. a $20 challenge. So I am going to go into the contour side with this. Again, it's Ooh. It's kicking up a lot of powder. Oh, you're using that. Um, okay. you're gonna use my phone. So I'm gonna kick this all over my eye, the lightest color, to give myself just a nice base. Um, it's so funny when Shannon and I were at the store, we were. I was like, how many eyeshadow products do you use on the daily when you're doing your face? Like eight to fifteen. That's what we figured out. I was like six to eight. I know, right? Crazy. And we're not like exaggerating. No. Really, like eight to fifteen, depending on the eye look. Natural yeah. look would be more like eight. That's so true. Which that's hilarious. I went for a natural look Actually, today. Actually, for a natural look today. <laughs> and we used eight eyeshadows. I know, right? Hmm, we could be excessive. You know what I have to say about this is they are blending really well. I'm really impressed with the blendability on this eyeshadow palette and I'm surprised I really I have to admit I don't have high hopes when it comes to drugstore products I want to so bad but um, I usually don't but I'm telling you if you've ever had all my eyeshadow I don't know if they're all like this but this palette's blending really well uh, on How my phone doing? it looks okay we'll see once I get the mirror if I really like the contour Would if you want this I'll switch you that's okay so wait a minute um, it's blending decently. There you go. All right. We'll see how so, it looks. So I am going to dual purpose mine. <laughs> I'm going to see if I can use it for my brows. Because I am, I'm blonde and I'm hoping I can get away with this shade for my brows. So yeah. we're going to see. There you go. I'm hoping you can too because if not, you're going to not have brows. I won't have brows. Yeah. All right. So actually, I'm pretty impressed with this eyeshadow palette. Pretty good, pretty good. All right, I can't use my camera for go that. Go for it. We're switching. We're switching. So here we go. I am going to blush it up. I'm going to use that lighter pink as my blush. 
And I'm actually going in with the blush first. I'm a little scared of that brown for my contour. Probably shouldn't be scared. It's going to be great. I'm using contour for brows. Okay. I'll try it. Actually, this isn't that bad at all. No? I don't think so. No, not at all. So it's giving you some depth. So you definitely, in a pinch, yes, can do you that. Yes, you use your contour sure. if you're blonde. Right. If you use a dark contour or you mm -hmm. have dark hair, use your phone. you're good. Um, you might not be able to get away with this. Me? I can. So obviously we did not include the price of our brushes in this because no. there would be no way. No. There would be no way. The question is, did we really do it? Did we? That is the question. Okay, so here, even beyond that, so Lisa, Lisa thinks she'll be surprised if we're under 20. There you go. Hey, hey. Richard. Um, so here's the next question I have for you. Who do you think out of the two of us spent the least amount of money? Did mm -hmm. I win? Did Jody win? Yeah. Who do you think? Let us know. Mm -hmm. You're seeing mm -hmm. the products we're using. Right? So you're, you're seeing it. Okay, let's, let's blend. How'd that work out um, you? I don't know. It's, I'm in a camera. You're in a camera. You know, she's been right in the days. Okay, who all back in the day, let's go back to college days, ladies. Who all like did their makeup in the back of the car on the way to the club? Okay. Okay, so I was thinking of like romper room and I see Jody and Shanna. Little bit different stories there. <laughs> yeah. Well Shanna was married during college days. I was not. I, so. I was. I had my first kid at twenty two, so so that yeah, was my twenties. I was still in the back of the, I was still in the back of the car putting on my makeup and the clothes for the night because usually I was leaving work and I was, you know. That's has any, did anyone else do that? Am I alone in that? I am sure you're not alone. I'm, I'm sorry. I can't commiserate. That's okay. I did do that for marching band. We had to change on the bus. Just okay. Saying. Well, there you go. All right. That's not. I can't tell. I'm in a. All right, you want the mirror switch? Are your yeah, brows? Yeah, my brows are oh, good. Oh, actually not bad. Yeah, I'm way to go, Wendy. Wild press. So if you are looking for a cheap intro to contouring, Wet n Wild Contour Kit palette. It's really good. Yeah. This isn't too okay. bad. Next. I could go out in public in this. So she went She's Alme for some. the eyes. I did. I went CoverGirl. You did. I'm kind of excited to see how these blend. I am too. So, so first I, things first, yeah. it comes with an applicator. Yeah, we don't it's use cloth. this. We, we don't. Not, okay, so this is why. They're hard no to shade blend. on people who use them. No. They're really hard for us to blend. The, usually mm -hmm. the sponge tip is a little too um, hard. It doesn't move it doesn't, the product around very well. Right. Wherever right. you put it, that's where it's staying. Yeah. You're better off with your fingers. Okay, I have to tell you something. That looks pretty good. That's not too bad. So was that just blush or blush and contour? That was blush and contour. That's not bad. I haven't highlighted yet, but I'm going for it. So I, I'm Be going fearless. to use this for blush. I'm yeah. going to take a little bit of the purple and some of the pink. Go for it. Let's see what happens. We're going to see what happens. This is fun. You said this would be fun. I this told you fun. it would be fun. I'm it having really fun. Are you guys fun. having fun? Are you really thinking, like, did they do it? I really want to know. And I want to know who you really think spent the most. Mm -hmm. Carrie says, it's hard to change high-end taste. Girl, let's talk. So true. Okay, this is not, I'm not going to be seen from outer space with this highlight. I don't even think it's a candlelight glow. Maybe. Maybe a candlelight glow. If you build it enough. Kind of, if you build it, they will come. Maybe if I keep building, the highlight will be there. The highlight will be there. Something like that. Should okay. I make that work decently? Actually, not too bad. Okay, so now onto the eyes. This is my favorite part, and I have four shades to work with. Yes. I have four shades. I normally mm -hmm. use 15. We have a problem. The way it is. Not bad. Okay. So we're going to attempt the pink shade. Have you even gone to your eyes yet? No, you're still yeah, on highlighting. No, I, no. Did I your eyes? Don't even. Right? Okay. Yes, I did my eyes, but they blended really well. It's a very natural look. I'm going to go back in and see if I can get it smoky or, or since it is date night. It, it's date night. 
It is date night, so we'll go in and kind of go a little smoky. But I don't, also don't want to take all my time on my eyes, <laughs> even though that is the part of my makeup that, that um, I spend the most time on. I know, me too. What part of your face do you spend the most time on? Like on a date night when you're going to take time mm -hmm. or even whenever. In the morning. Like what's the one product you're like, if I only can put one thing on, yes. what's it going to be? Right. Okay. okay. I can't tell on my phone how we're doing here. Here. That's okay. I'll just keep applying it. Here. Switch it. All right. So my eyes are kind of done. Kind of, kind of. All right, I'm going on to brows. I picked up an e.l.f. brow pencil. You I'm not splurged on a brow product. I did because it, everything's multitasking, right, ladies? So I'm going to use this as my eyeliner, too. So we didn't pick up any type of pencil. <laughs> I did. Oh, God. <laughs> this is the end that does the brow, Thanks. and that's the end with the spool. Thanks, Just Jan. In case. Thanks for having my back You're there. You're welcome. Um, so, what what I'm laughing about is it's really hard to see in a phone. You want the mirror? Oh, no. <laughs> so, you know, we've made this ten times harder by forgetting our mirrors. I know, saying. right? Right. So, maybe we should do that. Can we do our makeup without a mirror? Hmm. Well, obviously, we're proving that we sort of can. I mean, ooh, this. Okay, so here's How's what I can tell you. The spoolie, spoolies matter to me when it comes to brows. And um, this spoolie is hard as a rock. So, like, I think I'm going to take eyebrow skin off. So, Michelle says foundation or mascara. She can't don't make choose. me choose. I, you know, I have, I have to admit, if I'm flying out the door, it's my Bosha BB cream, a mascara. And I usually have some kind of lip product in my purse. And mm -hmm. at some point in traffic, I'm putting that on. For me, it's brows, because otherwise, they're not there. Yeah. My brows. Okay. Um, I know I'm putting... When you're ready, if um, I can just... Eyeshadow on. Is it not showing? Oh, not very much. Not really. Well, I'm, a little bit. No. Okay. Never I'm mind. I'm using the dark purple. And we're on like coat four. Okay, so here's what I can tell you about this. I would not buy this brow pencil again. So this is why. Oh, jeez. This is why. Um, it's very hard. So, um, and when you press down on it to get the product out, then you get a harsh line. So it would not be, but it might make great eyeliner. Maybe. There are hopes for this. But it is really the tip is still sharp like you've not even really used I much. Know. just saying I know. I know right okay here okay do you want that back to do your eyes sure all right here's the test can she do eyeliner um can i do eyeliner with foam that is a true test right so carrie says mascara and my mineral peptide powder what is a mineral what peptide? What is a mineral? Yeah, I was like, well, I, like, I want to I know like more. Peptides. And is that like a foundation? Because I'm thinking like the bare mineral type thing. I am too, and I cannot see. Okay, gray is a little bit better. The purple took like five layers to get it kind of there. All right. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to. When you're red, yeah. Okay. There you go. Proof positive. I cannot do eyeliner. And there's no way. Actually, you know what, ladies? I'm telling you. Is that decent eyeliner? It actually is a decent eyeliner. The gray has redeemed itself. The purple's still not happy with. Yeah, it's actually a decent eyeliner. Because it's so hard. I wonder if it'll tight line. Here we go. We're going into dangerous She's territory. She's brave. She's tight territory. lining. Territory. I, you know. Lisa says it's by Roden and Fields and it's an excellent product. Ah, good to know, Lisa. Thanks. Yes. We'll have to look into that. Yeah. For all of her new products. For sure. Okay. 
That's who makes my needle roller, is Rodan and Fields. Yes, I know. Her and her needles. I can't live without my needles. I believe you. Yeah, it really is. Okay, so this actually will line your eyes well. It's still hard, so it's tugging a lot at my eyes, so I don't care for that. Right. But I'm telling you, in a pinch, if you need an eyeliner and you don't have a lot of money, I would say try it. And they did go darker in that. Jody got a lighter shade to match her brows, so you could even go darker. Yeah, they have had like a, oh, it was like a, they call it a dark brown, but I, it looked like black. I thought, yeah, oh it my, did. like there's no way. It was pretty dark. Yeah. All right, well, when you're done with the mirror, we'll see how I did on my lower <laughs> lash line. Go for it. I have a pencil, there it is. Okay, so there's that. I'm actually going to put a little bit, uh, well, okay. So here we go, mascara. See, you can't live without mascara, me either. So here's the deal. This is the Super Size Fibers 100, oh no, let me take that back. 400% volume and length, 400%. 400. So by the time I'm done with this, Your my eyelashes should be like up to here. Yeah, mid, mid forehead, I think. That's thinking. awesome. So this has fibers, it's fiber link formula. I have never tried this, although I've seen really good reviews about it. I won't tell you what so, I think of it until you put it on, because I have it. Okay, well that's good to know. And I didn't want to sway her at the store, so I didn't say anything. Yeah. Okay, it smells like mascara chemically. So it has a very um, small, very, very small rubbery wand. I don't even know if you can see it. Teeny tiny. It is teeny tiny. Teeny tiny. But what's great is it kind of goes like this. It does. Like, do you see it? Like it yeah. gets longer at the ends at the Yeah. So yeah. So we will see. I did not curl my eyelashes. So So for me, going back to the eyeshadow palette. Um, I liked everything. I liked these two. I should take that back. These two were kinda okay. Okay. Gray, not bad. The taupey shade. Actually, your eyes look nice. Really nice. Yeah. I'm actually going to use the taupe as a highlighter. Okay. We're going to we're going to see how that works. Oh my gosh. Carrie says it's a lightweight, buildable coverage loose powder by Rodin and Fields, and it's good for your skin and gives you SPF. And SPF is so important. It is so important. You know what? Do you like it? I think I do. I can't say 400%. But look at the difference. That's really good. I like it, but it's uh, it's my every it's my everyday mascara. I use the four hundred percent one for my everyday mascara. You guys, what's your favorite mascara? Like, do you guys have like a fave that you cannot Ooh. live without? I know I do. Is this build? Is this buildable? I am super surprised. Oh my gosh. I am super uber surprised. So I think you can see my highlight from space. <gasps> you, got some, you got some unicorn highlight going on there. You know what I'm saying? You always wanted to be a unicorn. I did. Yeah. We go into Sephora and she's like, look at this lip. Look at this. And I'm yeah. like, look at I glow. Yeah. She's like, she comes back and she's like glitter and glow. And I'm like, Excuse me, I we found one. Okay, on. so like rabbit hole, we found one. It was like liquid unicorn tears, and I put a drop on, and it covered my whole arm. I'm like, oh my gosh, Jody, look at me, it and she's crazy. like, crazy. Where? And I'm like, I found the unicorns. <laughs> Just she crazy. did. Oh my gosh, it was crazy. Seriously crazy. Yeah, actually, first impression. It'll be interesting okay. to see how it wears during the day because the fiber, fiber um, mascaras that I've used um, in the past have flaked during the day. Okay. So. Well, I am using e.l.f. This is a new product. It's their Lengthening and Volumizing Mascara. So um, Lisa uses Trish uh, McVoy. Mc... Okay, we're both stumped. No, I'm serious. I have only had a sip of that. Um, Mc, I, McAvoy? McAvoy. McAvoy. I there we go. It. I haven't tried that. I, I can't pronounce Charlotte it. Charlotte Tilbury. Oh my gosh, if you're going to splurge on something, go to North. That is So what is your go-to? My go-to 
is Tarte's um, Tees. I think it's called Tees. No, it's not. That's CoverGirl. <laughs> I use that on my lower lashes. Tartist. Lashes. Tartist. Yes. yes I that use is Tarte. mine. Yes. I use Tarte Tartist, and you got me hooked on it. Um, I did use Lights, Camera, and Action. I should stop. I will have... I'll keep building. I love mascara. Um, I did use Lights, Camera, and Action. I still think that's a really good one. I haven't mm -hmm. tried Man Eater. Have you? No, um, but I like um, the Better Than Sex by Too Faced. Okay, it is good. It is really good. All right, you guys. I had to get lips. Here's the deal. I really love lipstick. I do. It just makes me happy. And so um, I got Vintage Wine by CoverGirl, Continuous Color. I've not tried this lipstick at all okay. before. So yours was non-existent? Mine's short and fat. Oh, it is. How but do you I, like it? We've read... We've I, done, we've... I like the shorter one. Yeah. Um, I'm not there on the product yet. We're still applying, but... Well, if you want to use that, I can use a phone for lipstick. That I've would done be that. great. I've done that a couple times. Yeah. So... Definitely like the wand on this. It's easy to get really close. Yeah. It's it's not it's it's not tart, but it's not bad. Actually, it isn't bad. No. No. And I the size of that wand is nice. All right. I see. I think. So I did not choose to do eyeliner because I have hooded eyes and it tends to make my eyes look closed. So I'm just getting my mascara as close to the root of my lashes as I can, wiggling back and forth and allowing it to really darken the roots of my lashes and it will give me that faux eyeliner look. What do you think of the lipstick? I think I like it. How does it feel? It's very creamy. It'll be interesting to see if it bleeds. A lot of times creams will bleed. I like the feel. It doesn't smell bad. Actually, it doesn't. There's really no smell to it, which is good because a lot of That's times... That's good. Get, a lot of drugstore have that floral mm -hmm. scent. So it doesn't. I kind of like the sheen that it has. And I like the color. So way to go, cover girl. We'll Thanks. see. Um. We will see. I think this would be a really good everyday mascara. It didn't give me the length that yeah. I'm used to, but. All right, so for me, I have L'Oreal. And it is in the shade 590, and it's Blushing Berry. Yep. It is part of their classic line. I, you know what, I have to tell you, I love L'Oreal lips. I just do. They're classics. I, they don't bleed on me. Um. They come up with fun colors. They're affordable. So, we'll see. And Shanna went out of her comfort zone. Because she I got... Yeah. A color I don't normally do. Normally, I'm like pretty. nude. You are normally nude. I am. Lips. Yes, Just nude say. lips. Just nude lips. Usually wear clothes. Yeah. It's a good but thing. My, it is. <laughs> and we're stopping there because this is a G-rated show. Yes. <laughs> oh, my goodness. So, all right. There we go. Overall? Face on. Overall, not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Are you guys ready? Actually, not bad. That's not bad. No. You did good. I am pretty impressed. Okay, so here we go. We got... Mm-hmm. Where are they all? You got all your stuff? I got eyeshadow palette, brow, mascara, concealer, foundation, and lipstick. And I got foundation, concealer, contour, setting powder, brows. Mm -hmm. Yep. All the above. Eyeshadow palette that doubled as blush and highlight. Yes. Mascara and lips. Okay. So. So what do you think? Did we do it? Did we do it? So any guesses? Any guesses before we reveal of who spent the least amount? Mm-hmm. J or S? Any guesses? Mm -hmm. Any guesses? I know, right? Right? Well, while they do that, I'm going to take another step. I know, right? You guys have got to make this. It's so good. It's great because you get the sweet and salty. Mm-hmm. And the sticky. Mm-hmm. All right, you ready? Okay. Jody, how much did you spend? Here's the deal. I spent, before tax, $18.76. No, really. Mm -hmm. 
tell them how you did that. Okay. So I have a confession. Hey, Sharon, I have a confession. Um, I am a reformed extreme couponer. Like, literally. Seriously. No, like, I would We took to this, a class together. We did. I, I yes, I, um, I brought a person in to teach my friends how to coupon. So I had $9 of coupons. If I did not have those coupons, there was no way. No way, even doing a whole face in Wet n Wild or Elf, which is the least expensive yes. products um, that we that I there was no way there was no way to do it on twenty dollars. No, so yeah, Lisa is impressed. Yeah, and she thinks you spent a little bit more. Yeah, there you go. Are you ready? So, what was your pre-tax? Pre-tax total was a nineteen dollars and thirty-five cents. There you go. I saved how much? Five dollars on coupons. Yeah. So Jody beat me on coupons and the price, the just price. a little bit, by a little bit, just a little bit. So even with tax, mine came to twenty dollars and sixty three cents. Mine came to twenty dollars and ninety nine cents. So there you go. It is doable it with is. coupons. Without coupons, ladies, um, unless you go to the dollar store. If you're going to go to Walmart, which really has the the lowest prices yes. on makeup, um, it's you're going to have to spend twenty five. Yes. But yeah. that's still not bad. That's still not bad for a date night look. Look, so many people are on budgets. People are going back to mm -hmm. school. I don't know about you guys, but every our budget fluctuates some. So there are times when I get to go to Nordstrom's, and there are times where I have to rely on my tried and true drugstore yes. products. Yes. Yeah. Or moms with girls yes. that are getting into makeup. Mine, I absolutely love. I love that they're mm -hmm. girly. Mine do not get to shop at Sephora. No. They don't get to shop at Ulta. They get no. Walmart and Target. Right. Right. Because it's doable. Oh, gosh. Well, ladies, thanks so much for joining yes. us tonight. It was so much fun. It's wild. You have to message us or leave comments if you like this type of episode where mm -hmm. we challenge ourselves to something that we've not done before. It was so much fun. Uh, it was. I agree. Great idea, Shan. Thanks. Yeah. All right. So until next week, be beautiful. Bye. Bye.